Hello there beautiful people, I hope you're doing well and welcome back again to OnHow channel. For people that don't know, my name is Enes, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop them below in a comment and I will be happy to make a video for you. And for people that do know, welcome back. Please be a witness for that for over 200 videos so far on Shopify customization because they were mostly requested by you guys, I mean subscribers. And some people not even subscribers but I'm fine with that, I still make the video for them. As always, just a like button, it's all I'm asking. Or actually, hold on a second. If you are interested in Shopify customization, you want to be an expert, you want to learn how to do anything yourself without having to hire a developer, why not subscribe to the channel, man? I don't have anything to sell. I don't sell any courses, never will. I don't have any paid memberships on the channel. So every little thing I do create, including the codes and the videos, how to implement those codes, are completely free on my channel. And not just any random videos. Those videos are actually questions and requests from people. People actually ask me how to do certain things. I make videos for them. So it's a win-win situation. But it's your decision. I'll let you choose and I respect your decision. Just a like button as I said if this video helped you or Even if it didn't, so drop me a comment. I will be happy to provide you the information you need in order to do the thing you're trying to do. And here I am again back with another requested video as always which is how to resize the add to cart button text and make it bold on your Shopify store. You can choose if you want to make it bold, I will show you how to do that. If you want to resize it, I will show you how to do that. If you want to do only one of them, I will show you how to do that. So no worries. And again, we will use our own custom code as always. And without any more talking, let's just jump to it. As you can see, this is the Shopify dashboard. And they have here down team, which is the one I do demonstrations on. So every uh, cold or every video you create I do demonstration on down team because it's the most used one also is the most requested one from people But if I scroll down in here I have every other free the most used again Shopify teams Which is refresh spotlight taste sense and trade and if you are wondering why is that because I do actually try my codes behind the scenes on all of these teams to make sure that even if you're not using down team, using one of these, it should work for you just fine. And I just have to say this in the beginning to give you that peace of mind because you're gonna see me doing it on down team in the video and you might be thinking, oh, maybe it's not working for the others. No, it is. And here is your peace of mind. And without the way, let's just get to it and show you how to resize the add to cart button text or make it bold on your Shopify store. And this is the Shopify store where I do all the tricks. So every little thing that you see on the Shopify store, I did it in tutorials, literally everything. So if you saw anything in the Shopify store that you liked and you think it looks good and you want to implement it in your store as well, then just check out the channel. Because once it's here, that means it's already done and posted in one of my previous videos. Because I don't remove the, uh, the, the changes from the Shopify store. I keep them so people can see them. So let me access some product to show you what I'm about to do. Oh yeah, check out how many things in here. All the things in here, I did them in tutorials. Shaking uh, effect on the buttons, order on WhatsApp button with the link for the product as well as the message, default message and this widget that shows random people are watching the product right now. And this number will change every time you reload the page and randomly pick number between a number this and this. You can choose which number you want. And all of this without using single application. So make sure to keep that in mind. In this video, as I said, I will show you how to resize the text on add to cart button and make it bold as well if you want. So we will keep this page open, do the trick, come back and see it in action. So get back to Shopify dashboard in here. And after that, click on the three dots on left of customize and click on edit code. Then it will take you to the code editor for your Shopify team. And in here, we need to find a specific file. Instead of looking at the folders, you might get dizzy or something. Simply use the search bar at the top left corner and type in again. I have to mention this for the million times. So it's gonna be either base.css or team.css or style.css. And some rarely custom made teams is gonna be custom.css, but they mostly use base or team or style. I know mine is base, I'm gonna type in base. Uh, here it is, base.css, click on it, after that scroll all the way down, let me drag this because it's a huge file, here we go, after that, in here, at the bottom of the file, we need to create some space to paste in our code, but in case there is no space, simply click front of the last thing in here, which is in my case, it's closing bracket, then hit enter on your keyboard, here we go, we have a completely new line to paste in our code. And where are you gonna get that code? As always, from the description box. Scroll down the description box and you will see a link named as code. Click on it and it will take you to this beautiful page with this very short code that will do the trick for us. So obviously, you know what font size is. Font size is font size. You want it bigger, increase the number. You want it smaller, decrease the number. And this is the font weight. The font weight is bold. You want it normal, Remove this line right here and it's gonna be as default. You want it more bolder, type in here bolder. 
add an A or an R, here it's going to be bolder. And if you don't want to resize it, you just want to make a bold, just remove, remove this line. That's very simple, right? So select the whole code in here, make sure to select the dot as well as the closing bracket, right click, copy, and we will get back in here and paste it at the bottom of the file. Now if we click save button, wait for a couple of seconds, it's save it, we will get back in here, reload the page, and see what that will do. Check it out, much bigger now as you can see. Maybe it's too big like this, don't make it like this. Maybe it's too big, yeah. It's too huge. So make sure to play around the number to exit to get uh, a style that suits your Shopify product page. And that's how you resize the add to cart button text and make it bold if you want as I showed you in your Shopify store by using your own code. So if you have any questions make sure to drop them below but for now I think my job is done. So thanks for watching, catch you on the next one.